Hi everyone, today I am here with a requested video. I am sure this is really useful for the GNM students all over India. Before going to the video, be sure to click the subscribe button and the bell notification so you don't miss any single video. GNM is a three year nursing program. However, through this video, I am going to explain about the first year exam question papers and the model questions. In the first year, as per the Indian Nursing Council syllabus, students have four board exams. They are the first paper is bioscience which include three subjects that means anatomy, physiology and microbiology. Second is behavioral science include psychology and sociology. Next subject is nursing foundation and another one is community health nursing. Today we can focus on bioscience. First year GNM students will learn minimum 19 hours for both anatomy and physiology and 30 minutes for microbiology. After that, students gain the knowledge of structure and function of the human body and recognize any deviation from the normal health in order to render effective nursing services. Upon completion of the anatomy and the physiology classes, the students shall be able to describe in general structure and functions of the human body. Next is describe in detail the structure and the function of different organs and systems in the human body. Next, apply the anatomical and physiological principles in the practice of nursing. Study microbiology helps the students to describe the classifications and characteristics of microorganisms and list the common disease producing microorganisms. Next is explain the activities of microorganisms in relation to the environment and the human body. Next enumerate the basic principles of control and the destructions of microorganisms. Apply the principles of microbiology in nursing practices. Students will have learned all these things in their one year of studies. However, we are helping them to prepare more for the exam through this video. Cracking these model questions before the board exam may help you score more. Alright, now I am going to tell you about different types of questions and they might be asked. First one is give the meaning of the following. Here you will get four questions and each question carries one mark. Some students have been dragged this out but there is no need for this just to give the exact answer in a short way. Now I will explain how we can write an answer in a perfect way. The first question is larynx. So how we can write that? The larynx is also known as a voice box and it is located in the anterior neck. It is the component of respiratory tract and has the several important functions including phonation and cuff reflex and the protection of lower respiratory tract. Then I will give another example that is extension. Extension refers to the movement that increases the angle between two body parts. In another words, we can write like this. It is the movement that increases the angle between two bones and the body part that take place in the posterior directions. Same like questions maybe you will get like uh, that means the terms related to the body movements. I will just tell the example you can note down flexion. Abduction, adduction, rotation, circumduction, pronation, supination, retraction, protraction, dorsal flexion, plantar flexion. Okay, next type of question is pulmonary circulation. How we can write the answer? Simply we can write pulmonary circulation moves the blood between the heart and the lungs. Then next is cytology. Cytology is the study of structure and the function of cell. Then next is histology. Histology is the study of tissues and their function. Next uh, type of next question is meiosis and mitosis. So we need to study the difference. Meiosis means meiosis is the type of cell division taking place during gamete formation in the organisms having sexual reproduction. Meiotic division gives rise to four haploid daughter cells from one diploid cells. Mitosis means it is essentially the process of replicating the cellular chromosomes and then segregating this into two identical daughter cells. Next maybe you will get a question like what is anatomy. So you can write anatomy is the uh, science which deals with the structure of the human body. 
Next example of one question is trachea. It is also known as windpipe which is the main airways to the lungs. In addition, the trachea is the flexible and the cartilaginous tube. Okay, next maybe you will get a question like a neuron. So, there are the building blocks of the nervous system. They receive and they transmit signals to the different parts of the body. Alright, next is menopause. Menopause means is the physiological cessation of the menstrual cycle uh, associated with the advanced aging. Then I will tell uh, some one word questions that is related with the microbiology. Maybe you will get a question like that. What is microbiology? So microbiology is the study of microbes or living organisms. Examples the organs, microorgans. Okay, next may be like a spore. A spore is a cell that contains fungi plants and bacteria produced. Spores are involved in the reproduction. Certain bacteria make the spores as the way to defend themselves. Spores have thick walls and they can resist in high temperature, humidity and other environmental conditions. Then commonly asking or repeatedly asking one question is infection. So what is infection? Infection can be defined as the entry of germs in the body of the individual followed by the multiplication of thus leading to the formation of specific or non-specific reactions in the body with or without any clinical symptoms or diseases. Next is immunity. So immunity is the resistance produced by the body against the microorganism and their products. Then asepsis. So what is asepsis? Asepsis is without infection. Example, without the presence of any microorganisms or any microbes. Apart from this, I will tell you some more questions. Don't forget to work on it before your examinations. I like a microorganism, antigen, autoimmunity, pasteurization, hypersensitivity, disinfection, neuron, ingestion, fertilization and etc. Okay, then we can move to the next category of questions that is filling the blanks questions.